Hi guys, I wanted to show you my kitchen and how much stuff I have on it. It's just too jam-packed, it's very, very cluttered, and I'm getting ready to, to get the house ready for my daughter's first birthday party here, and I just want it to be clean and clear and just, I don't know, to me it just changes the energy of the kitchen when you don't have so much stuff there and we don't use 90% of the stuff you know on a daily basis so I wanted to take a little quick clip of how it looks before this is just some more footage of my extremely crowded counter space I mean it's not horrible but I just know it can be better so this is what it looks like We're gonna do something about this and hopefully make it just look cleaner and clearer. My island's a whole nother story, I mean, and um, just a whole bunch of just clutter, 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 stuff everywhere. So anyway, I will show you guys the after. Just finished decluttering my counter space. And I absolutely love it. I don't think my kitchen has ever been this clear, probably since we bought our home six years ago, or five, excuse me, five years ago. I'm so happy, and I'm really gonna work hard on trying to keep it this way, because my island is typically a, just a dumping ground for us, because my garage door is just right here. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna take you through and tell you what I did. I just found a space for everything. That's the bottom line. Everything just has to have a space. The only thing I left out was my toaster, and that's because we I use that every morning to make breakfast. I even cleared some of the my daughter's artwork on the um, refrigerator. It was just starting to become too cluttered, so I just kept a few pieces out. And then I even decluttered this little space. It was just jam-packed. It was just almost like a clutter corner that I cleaned out. I just left this out because that is for my daughter's party next weekend. And so I cleaned everything, put everything away, and I'm just really happy with it. The only things, if you remember, I had like little um, decorative pieces over in the back of the um, stovetop. Just didn't need it. I just left out literally what I liked. You know, I even don't even like the knives out, but I, it's just pointless for me to try to put them in the sink underneath, or in, excuse me, in a cabinet underneath because I use those daily to cook. Um, I mean, I guess I could find the space, but it doesn't bother me that much. Uh, I love this Paris Eiffel Tower piece, so I love, left that out. And basically just the um, paper towel holders, and that's it. I really, really like it. Um, that's my water bottle that I take to work every day. That's why I leave it there. And then we come here, and I left this because it's it functions for us, for my daughter right now. Um, her first birthday's next weekend. She's gonna be off of formula. This is just a temporary thing. Um, the baby food, you know, she she usually eats as a snack. So this is very temporary, but as soon as she's out of this stage, there will be nothing over here either. So I'm really happy about that. Another plus with me clearing out this space is that it makes the my underlighting under the cabinets look so much better. And I'll show you how that looks. I love it. It just looks so pretty. We did the underlighting ourselves. We bought the kit from Ikea and we just put it in there. We installed it underneath there when we first moved in and I love it. I think it's just a great touch to the kitchen. It makes it look so, I don't know, just, of course I have an open floor plan and I have a lot of counter space to work with, but now it makes it for the perfect landscape for my daughter's party. I'm just really, really happy with it. We plan on laying all the food out here on the island. It's completely cleared off. This is never, I've never had it like this before. So I'm really, really happy with the way it turned out and I hope it motivates someone else. If you're feeling like someplace in your home is just causing like anxiety and just like the energy is not good. I suggest just literally clearing out, clearing it out, clear the space out, throw some stuff away, put some stuff away, and it really makes a world of difference. So until next time guys, see you later.